Mr. Collector here with another video. Before the video starts, I want to let you guys know to make sure you hit that subscribe and notification button. It really helps out showing the support for the channel. I do a bunch of other stuff besides gaming. I do drawing, building, collecting, uh, workouts, cooking, um, and then a bunch of other cool stuff with my friends. Um, and if you want to me to put me posting more videos each day, make sure you hit that subscribe button and let me know. Uh, but besides that, let's get right into the video. All right, everyone, this is Stunt Collector here with another G.I. Joe action figure review. So right here I got Bishop, or not Bishop, what am I talking about? Roadblock. Um, and uh, this, we already have one. This is not the same one as the one that I have, though. It's really different. Uh, but yeah, here's the front. Here's the side. Here's the back with the island that they're in. And the other side with the box art there. Top and then bottom with the DCBI. But let's crack this thing open. All right, here's Bishop out of the packaging. We'll do a, um, like a uh, side by side comparison with the other one. But for accessories, he comes with these nice looking sunglasses here. They did a really good job on them, actually. Looks pretty much like sunglasses. Like the little details that they added for the lines there. It's really cool. And then he comes with this blaster that he came with the other time, but this time it's not as like I, I think this one's a lot more cooler. It's darker. It has this blue right here. Doesn't have that translucent apparent blue. I'll show you actually. Let's do a comparison here. Let's take this off of him. I have him ready. Oh there we go. So here it is. It's the same mold. So here's the one that we have in the package right now. It says, um, bro, bro, I don't know what it says there. Broiler? I don't know. And then here's the other one. It doesn't have that on there, that decal there. But it has a lot more, a little more detailing than that one. But they don't have that transparent blue there. I like this one a lot more because it's darker. But I wish they kind of did add a little more because if you see here at the very end, they had that blue right there. They could have added some blue with the circles right there. So, same deal. Here, maybe flip it. There we go. And the other thing. Oh, yeah, you can. It, was, it just came like that. But here's that mag there that I came with. And here's the other one. This one has a little more detailing. And flip, same thing. You can mix and match them, I'm pretty sure. It won't hurt. And yeah, there's there's his blasters for you. And let's get let take a look at Bishop here. So this one is a comp very different Bishop here. New uh, face sculpt here. So he has a bigger beard. Here's the other one right next to it. Bigger beard, and he has that bit like, um, that bandana or head right, uh, hat thing right there, and he has this earpiece connected to it. Whereas this one doesn't. He has a thicker beard here. And then the other thing, which actually helps with the articulation, doesn't come with this vest, which which strains it. I'll go over the articulation here too. I'll do a comparison with that too. He has that cool tattoo like the other one does. I like the like camouflage, like Arctic kind of look with the shirt here with that star across his chest. I like that look a lot. Pants look good. He has that knee pad holster right there. Or not holster, it's like a fanny pack with some smoke grenades there. He has this arm piece right here. I think that's supposed to be a farm guard with some ammo or something. And the gloves are just black. Same deal with the other arm. He has this knee pad, but no other detailing besides black and then boots. But besides that, that's all. But let's go over. And then you just put the sunglasses over his eyes like this. And you have that. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but there's that little slot there. So you could just slide it in there. So you just try to get it in like that. And then boom. 
and then you have it on which actually stays on pretty good looks pretty cool with him but let's go over his articulation so you can get him to look down that far and he also has this weird piece right here so it may mess up the articulation with going up yeah it kind of does and then you get them to look side to side uh head just a very little amount of head pivot you get his arms to go up that far um he has a butterfly joint same deal with the other gi joes it doesn't really move that much but you get to move a little bit uh you got 360 rotation around the shoulder you got bicep swivel double jointed elbows wrists can hinge down <clears throat> that far and up that far and then 360 rotation and then he has an ab crunch here so you can go down that far backwards that far and then he has that that, uh, that hip joint the ball joint there so you get him to go down that far and then up that far let's take the glasses off here and then one i just realized this now this kind of piece with his pants it kind of gives him that like diaper look kind of it's kind of loose for me i'm not sure if it's the same thing with the others but it's a little loose right here so if you like get him to go down a little bit you can see that it kind of gives it that diaper look a little bit but um he has a little bit of a drop down hip right here so you get him to kick out that far pretty good forward really good and then backwards decent uh he has a thigh cut yeah double joints knees there we go yeah shin cut yeah Ankles that can hinge down that far, up that far, and you got nice ankle pivot. And then for the articulation on this side, so the, the only difference between them is that this one has the vest, this one doesn't, so you get them to go down that far, whereas this one, like none. So this one's definitely better, and I think it looks a lot more badass compared to the other one. So yeah. So definitely a better, massive improvement compared to the other one. Um, and I think this guy looks a lot more badass to the, compared to the other one too. Has one extra, ex well actually this one came with a knife. So it's kind of the same amount of accessories. Just used a knife for that one instead. Um, but yeah, really cool figure. Did a better job on the articulation, mainly because of the vest. So I think they could have done something with the vest actually. But... This one's much more badass looking, and I actually like the improvements a lot. Um, but yeah, that's all I've got for him. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out my buddy's Instagram page at Highlight Photos. He does really cool photos. Also, my two best friends that I usually play Call of Duty with, sometimes with other games. They have card pages. Christian's card page is BadBuke767. Uh, Connor's card page, well, he doesn't really have one at the moment. His Jeep's gone. He has a new car. I will update it when he like decides to put up an Instagram page for it. Um, to uh, sending, donating to my PayPal, it's supposed to help me out with getting, get me being able to do that and I'll also get more games uh, to reactions to. When I get the PS5, uh, I'll do a review on it. And then also the games for it, um, more camera, better camera equipment, uh, and a few other things to help make the views a little bit better. And then uh, I will try putting up my own merch store at some point. I just need time to do it. I'm in the middle of baseball right now. I will figure out some way to do it. I do not have a laptop myself at the moment. So if you guys could help me out by donating to my PayPal, it would be really awesome. But besides that, I, um, if you really enjoy my nerdy, funny, gaming, uh, workout, uh, sports videos, other stuff like that, uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.